Hi there everyone, I hope that you are doing well. Today I'm coming to you with this beautiful dish, Middle Eastern dish, it's uh, fava beans. And we will cook it from scratch. So I've soaked the beans for 12 hours or so, and then I'm gonna use the fastest way to cook it, which is the electric pressure cooker. I'm using the NutriCook today. And as you can see, I have rinsed the beans from the water, and then I'm now putting it inside the pressure cooker. Uh, I will add to it only cumin. I don't add salt because it will delay the cooking time uh, and then I will add water just a little bit above the beans because as you know the pressure cooker it doesn't allow the water to evaporate and then I'm gonna use the lentil or the beans uh, program and then I'm gonna be adding it up until 55 minutes and this is all it takes for it to be cooked and as you can see after it cooks it's quite tender and mush the grains or the beans itself as you can see and this is one of them see it's very tender and very mushy now I'm, I'm transferring it to into another cooking pot to allow it to reduce its heat so that I can store it inside plastic bags and into the freezer because the pressure cooker tends to keep the heat for a long time and this is two recipes for it to use it how to use it the first recipe it's a traditional egyptian recipe or arabic recipe this is uh, water salt cumin and we will uh, mash it with the masher and cook it over the heat for like a few minutes and then after that we will put the juice of half a lemon or you can put an entire lemon it depends on your taste stir it and then drizzle it with olive oil actually i like it drained in olive oil if i may put it this way and this is the first recipe second recipe will be i'm using ghee you can use definitely if you want to go entirely vegan you can use olive oil again or you can use butter it's up to you and then two cloves of garlic i'm crushing them and then frying them into the uh, inside the ghee until they are golden to that i will add cut tomatoes i have used two to three tomatoes you can add more and i will add uh, black peppers cumin and crushed or powdered coriander seeds uh this is up to your taste for sure as you can this is a small uh, teaspoon so check and add as much as you want and i'm gonna be cooking them until the tomato pieces are broken and tender meanwhile i'm gonna be using some of the beans that we have cooked earlier and i will put some water on top of it mash it a little bit with the masher or with a fork whatever is available and then i'm gonna be adding it to my tomato and um, garlic sauce cook it for like two or three minutes maximum and then serve it that's it you can have it on its own with a salad on the side with some tahini tahini sauce as well and some bread as we uh, like arabs we eat it with bread and that's it for today i hope that you liked the video and i hope it was uh, light and quick if you liked my videos don't forget to thumbs up give me a like and subscribe to my channel and until i see you next time i wish you all best of luck happy easter to all of you and enjoy your day and stay safe always have a good day bye